talk to you about something a little bit different today when it comes to Native American Indian artifacts. Um, in looking at the arrowhead set that I've found over the years and the ones that Gil has found, there are some very beautiful hunting pieces. One thing I never thought about, though, is that some of those may have been used to actually kill somebody. There were many battles that were fought on the rivers in this area of Michigan where I live. Um, so the possibility is definitely there. And I will look through my arrowheads to see if I can find any of the types so that I can show those to you. But I want to show you something else that could have been used um, in battle also. Now I'm going to show you here a war club that is a tourist piece from the 1960s. I'm just using it as an example, okay? Uh, it's an interest piece, a nice piece, 1960s, so it's vintage. But clubs were made similar, and they were used as skull crackers, or, uh, you know, to take down an enemy quick. And I wondered, again, you know, I've seen them from various parts of the country, and I wondered why I would never find any here in Saginaw. Um, especially knowing that there were so many battles fought here. Well, I think I finally have found one, and this is that piece, and it would go this way, actually. And if it was put on a handle similar to the one I just showed you, this would be mighty, mighty impressive. Uh, I guess maybe that's not exactly the right word. It would do a lot of damage to the skull if it was with all a man's might, you know, wrapped against his head. And actually, the blunt end would do... Uh, would do also. Now I found this uh, this piece here in Saginaw along the river and uh, it would where I found it I'm finding more middle woodland era um, artifacts judging by the pottery and the uh, and the projectile points arrowheads and such so I'm thinking that is a middle woodland item, although it could go back into the uh, into the early woodland because so much of what we f have found here in the area is from late archaic and early woodland. This piece, uh, to me, it's remarkable. And it, it's uh, kind of eerie, in a sense, to realize that that might have been something that took someone's life. So, a uh, little bit morbid, yeah, but I thought maybe I thought I'd bring this to you just... Uh, is something different. Um, you don't know what you're digging into. Not dig. I don't dig anymore. But you don't know what you're, what you're picking up. What its true history is. Oh yes. You know. I know that an arrowhead's a, an artifact. And, but you don't really know exactly what it might have been. What its purpose was. Did it kill a rabbit? Did it kill a deer? Or did it kill a person? All right, well, thanks for being here. Love you all very much. On the other side of that monitor, and God bless you all incredibly. See you soon, my friends.